off. Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of My Perfect Bite. I'm Micah from the Casa Kitchen and Bar, and today we're gonna be doing carbonara, a classic Italian dish. This time around, I'm doing my version of carbonara. So let's get down to it. This time around, I'm gonna be using linguine, number 13, you can find it in any supermarket. And I've got some eggs, I've got some hard cheese, I've got some bacon bits that you can find in the supermarket as well. Crushed black pepper, cloves of garlic, and a bit of an onion. We're gonna season pasta water with one spoon of salt. I'm using three whole cloves of garlic, Give your garlic a bit of a peel. Don't cut them too thin as well because we sort of want to infuse the oil with a bit of garlic, yeah? So, well, yeah, I think. Now for the onions. All you want to do is just use half. You're not going to use the whole thing. I'm going to dice this up relatively fine. Two, one, two, and then down, one, down. So now for the eggs. We're gonna be using two whole eggs for this portion. Inside, we're just gonna put a bit of pepper and we're gonna grate in some cheese. Very nice. So I'll just give it a whisk. Beautiful. So, bacon bits. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make the base of the sauce first. Melt down some of this pork fat. Like a, ooh. This is fast. Very good. I don't want to saute this too fast. I actually want this to render down. I want to use that fat and build my sauce from there. That smell is starting to come out and it is smelling phenomenal. Onions can go in. Bacon and onions, good friends. Bit of garlic. I think this is going to be quite a nice dinner. If you can clearly see over here, I'm creating a bit of a fond. And that font is going to develop a lot of amazing characteristics for the sauce. You know what? I'm going to mix this up a bit. And my secret ingredient for today is butter. Just sort of put that in. Sort of mix that through. Everyone should get an electric stove. I think it works amazing. Oh my gosh, look at that. Now, don't take your eye off it. It's going to be done very, very shortly. Oh my god. This smells so good. Now we can probably turn the power slightly more, a bit more down. Take a pinch of pepper and so I just sprinkle that in. Take a bit of that water. Right. That is the base of your sauce. So the minute you start adding the water inside, all that brown fond is going to be able to scrape off and that is going to make your sauce even better. Water is brought up to a boil. Now we are going to cook our pasta. About yay much. Yeah, it should be enough for about two people. You don't want to leave it alone. You sort of just um, wiggle it in, in a bit. You want all the pasta to be submerged inside the water. The box says nine minutes for al dente. Nine minutes for al dente. Right. Now pasta goes straight into the sauce. Take a little bit more of the pasta water. Now, we're just gonna sort of power down a bit. There's gonna be residual heat inside this pan. There it goes. You're gonna have to constantly monitor this. And you do not want this to scramble at all. It's turning super glossy, looking very, very nice. Just gonna give this a bit of a taste. Bit of cheese, bit of cheese. Pop pepper. Then now we're just gonna give it a bit more stir. And then look at how beautiful this is. Yummy! Mm. Et voila. Carbonara a la mi casa. Oh my god, look at that. That is absolutely delicious. Thank you very much for joining me on another episode of My Perfect Bite. I'm Micah from Picasso Kitchen and Bar. 
This is my carbonara dish that is loved by my wife and I. Join me next week where I'm going to share with you something really, really cool. See you next week.